rescue, an off-duty policeman saves a Melbourne family from their burning home. We're live from the scene. Monkey mystery. The search widens for a marmoset snatched from a wildlife park. Two men face court this morning. Ed Sheeran's face sliced with a sword. How a royal party prank went disastrously wrong. On your side. Revealing the secrets of rehab. How our sports stars fight back from addiction. It's a Today Show exclusive. and all-round superstar Danny Minogue is live on the show with a very special announcement. And the knock of cash is back. We are about to change the life of one very deserving Aussie. And a very good morning to you on this Monday, the 28th of November. Good morning to you, Dickie. Good morning, Lisa. <laughs> Carl. I'm not Carl. I, you know, I wish I was, obviously. But <laughs> no, I'm not. Carl's having a well-deserved day off today, yes, and uh, we have Deb Knight with us today. And, and I don't want to confuse anyone that it is not Sunday, it is in fact Monday. Even ah. though I'm here, it is a working day. It is Monday, a school you day. say. It's Indeed. a good day, is yes. what it is. Good having, weekend. Having you. I had a great weekend. Good. I did uh, the Steve Irwin Gala Ball Beautiful. on uh, Saturday night, which was fantastic. A lot of money raised for the Wildlife Warriors. Oh, well done, you. Fabulous and, uh, work that they do. Mm, mm. Good morning to the Irwin family and good morning also to Clint Stanaway who is live from Melbourne for us this morning. You've got all the latest sports news. We do, Lisa. Good morning to you from Melbourne. We're at High Sense Arena, the home of Melbourne United. We've got some kids here this morning. They'll arrive very shortly. They're celebrating a big win over Sydney. So more from Melbourne live right through the morning. We'll look forward to a few three-pointers from you throughout the morning too, Clint. Thank you for that. Let's get a Update on all the latest news, Deb. Let's do that, Dickie. Thank you. We begin in Melbourne, where an off-duty police officer has become a neighbourhood hero overnight after saving an Essendon family from their burning home. Today, Melbourne reporter Christina Hearn joins us now with more on this. Chris, what happened? Yeah, they kind of do some crazy things in that part of the world. Well, they specialise in it, don't they? They do, yeah. yeah. You know, spa treatments, I guess it's sort of the yin and the yang. It's sort of relaxing while you're being completely frightened to death. That's there true, and that's the way they like it. <laughs> Gee, it's an interesting news day, isn't it? You've got to say. We've got a mix, haven't we? <laughs> Lots <laughs> going do. on. OK, <laughs> thank you for that, Deb. Now, let's take a look at the weather around the country for you on this Monday morning. And Brisbane, you've got a partly cloudy day and 29, a possible shower in Sydney and 27 your high, 21 in Melbourne and mostly sunny. Adelaide, mostly sunny as well, and 29. Perth, sunny and 29. And Darwin, a shower or two, possible storm and 33 degrees. A gorgeous day in this fair country of ours. And it's a big day in sport as well. Let's get the very latest from Clint, who's looking very athletic for us this morning. Good morning, Clint. I am Deb. Good morning to you. We are courtside at High Sense Arena here in Melbourne right through the morning. Now, ask anyone here in this fine city of Melbourne, and they'll tell you a win over Sydney is worth celebrating. Of course, that happened on Saturday night. So celebrate they will. Plenty of sport coming up right through the morning. Skipper Steve Smith names the players behind Australia's rise out of the cricket crisis. Plus, the NFL club circling star league duo Jason Tamalolo and Valentine Holmes. Also ahead, the knock of cash is back. Don't miss our Stevie changing the life of one incredibly deserving Aussie. And all action actress Kate Beckinsale is back for more vampire slaying. We're going to catch up with a superstar a little later in the show.